when we are creating tutorials, such as handicraft guides or yoga videos, there might sometimes appear clutter in the shooting environment that is difficult to clean up. Well, the fact is that it can be processed using AI. And in today's video, we will show you how to do it. If you are interested in this one, keep watching the video. In this tutorial, we will use Photoshop AI. Recently, Adobe has released a new beta version of Photoshop, which includes AI painting. It can generate new content based on the existing image. So we can use this feature to remove unnecessary elements from the video and make the footage cleaner. However, it is important to know that the camera must remain fixed without any shaking when shooting the video. First, we need to install the beta version of Photoshop. Open the browser and enter this website. Download Creative Cloud and install it. After installation, click on Beta app and find Photoshop Beta. Click Try to download and install it. You will have a 7-day free trial period. Now, we open Vidipop Blogger. Create a new project, which will bring us to the main interface. Then, let's import the original video material to the overlay track and make it fit to the screen. Make sure the timeline is at the first frame. And then we click on this button to take a screenshot of the frame. After getting the image, let's open Photoshop Beta. And open the screenshot. Use the lasso tool to select unwanted parts. Then click this button. Generative field. Next, click Generate directly. We we'll wait for a few moments. And the system will generate three images. You choose the most suitable one. Of course, you can also add some prompt words in the input box. And wait for the generation. After that, select a suitable image. Click File. Export. Click Export to PNG to export the image. Then import the exported image back into Vidipop Blogger. And put it into the video track. Adjust the duration. Then select the material on the overlay track. And click here to enter the crop editor. Drag the border to remove the cluttered parts, like this. Once finished it, we drag the playhead to ensure the main subject is not cropped out. Click Apply. After returning to the main interface, we need to align the cropped image with the original one. Drag the playhead to the first frame. Select the material on the overlay track and drag it in the preview window. You can adjust the opacity to 0.5 for easier adjustment. That's how the effect is achieved. Similarly, when shooting some handicraft videos, this method can also help to remove some cluttered items in the surroundings. Well, this is all for today's video. And if you want to know more about other intrigues or what has been going on with Video Blogger, be sure to click the subscribe button to subscribe channel if you haven't yet. And we'll see you soon in our next video. Hope you enjoy. Bye bye.